navigating goes opposite way wherever you take the cursor it goes the opposite of what where you want it to go if you go up it goes down if you go down it goes up if you go left it goes right if you go right it goes left so it goes against my finger my finger my finger goes left the cursor goes right my finger goes right the thing the cursor goes left and so on how to solve this problem the first thing i think the first thing come to my mind is to update the touchpad driver touchpad driver to update the touchpad driver what i have done is go to dell so to solve this problem to solve it as i told you i will just download a new driver from dell support so what i will do i'll just bring another laptop here which is working perfect in google i'll go there and type uh, before i tap let me check what is this laptop it is dell is you can see their latitude turn it to the back and read one second read here i can't see can you see it i can see it myself it says e latitude e63 e6320 latitude e6320 at the back of the laptop so back here again this laptop has a problem with the touch pad it goes the opposite direction so bring a working laptop to download a driver so in google i will just type a keyword let's say latitude e six three e six three twenty then touch pad touch pad driver is looking for all I think not eBay for sure I can see it in Dell touch pad driver okay disable touchpad now is not this sorry i wasn't watching properly back to here hmm, stop this that's slow what is it doing oh, no let me go to dell in the second time So as we said, so this is the second laptop. If you type something like E6320 touchpad driver, then go to, make sure you go to a, a Dell website where you can download it. Okay, click there. You can see And you can see the website there from Dell. Support, enter keyword, keyword I can say just E63. Let me focus on this E6320 touch pad. E6320 touch pad in search. that search then the touch pad appear the one I have tried is it, com it, com it comes with many drivers I believe all will work but I just tried the latest one which is on 17th January 
19 2019 so this is the latest one download it there when you download it it comes automatically in the download file here it's called it's called drvr the driver win r298 dot 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 axa open it and open open this folder then go to download then locate this driver as we say it is called I can see the driver is here what I will do I will just right click it and send it to where to send it I will send it to Bluetooth network on the board desktop create for DVD no I want to send it to this US USB drive uh, USB drive here send it there okay click send to then confirm and when it's done it keeps blinking done what we do take it off and move this laptop put it back in this stick the USB driver there and open the folder to locate this uh, file and run it into this window so when you navigate in this PC the one where the touchpad is not working locate the driver which is here in the USB USB is this one we just brought from the other computer double click to open it and find that driver here where is the driver let me scroll down oh, scrolling is a problem up goes down down goes up still but I still can do it anyway and I can find the driver here if you remember is DRV win R298 this is let me get it there scroll up is down down is up it's very hard to do it anyway I got used to it a little bit this is it double click double click the driver still not working yeah run run we run the driver to the end okay the driver is running do you want to allow this app to make changes yeah I have to say yes of course yes do you want to allow this app of course I say yes After running the driver, touch. Oh, yes, it works. Finally, scroll up is up and scroll down is down. Right is right, left and left. Everything works fine. Thanks. This is the second time I encountered this problem. Solved it in two different ways. Finally, is done. Thank you for watching.